in the race to be Maine's next governor, education policy is now front and center. Yeah, Paula Page is starting to unveil his campaign policies, and earlier this week he laid out his plan for Maine schools. He's pitching changes to school choice and what he calls increased transparency for parents. New Center Maine's Jackie Mundry takes a closer look, including what educators and Democrats have to say about it. Paula Page is proposing what he calls the Parents' Bill of Rights. He says test scores are down and kids are behind on basic reading, writing, and math skills because of the pandemic. We need to go back to teaching our kids how to think, not what to think. LePage also says he wants to see more transparency in schools and that parents need to know what is being taught in their child's school. He says parents have had to file a public information request to see their kids' curriculum. Educators say there isn't a transparency problem. What's, what's not transparent? Steve um, Bailey works for the Maine School Board Association and says some of the things in the Parents' Bill of Rights are already in place, or we have the tools to make them a reality. LePage has been a longtime supporter of school choice. The minute that the parents are empowered to select the schools for their children, all schools will get better very quickly. He proposes a voucher program so students can choose to go to a public, private, religious, or charter school and bring state education funds with them. State I Representative Michael Brennan is the chair of the Education no Committee and says that won't work. There's not a whole lot of evidence that voucher, voucher programs work uh, across the country. And to interject something like that would really destabilize the public school system in the state of Maine. LePage is also calling on parents to get more involved in their child's school by establishing a parents governing board and adding parents to the State Board of Education. In Portland, Jackie Mundry, New Center, Maine.